And because of all the media libraries that are all free, a lot of people you know, promote their own themselves, uh, upload photos and videos, uh, um, uh, uh, create the songs and upload to iTunes. And th this is actually the world where people can uh, uh, pr produce our contents. And there's a new phrase called prosumer. Prosumer is actually the producer and consumer of information. So anyone can be the prosumer and everyone become the prosumer. So this is actually uh, what we believe it's true. And uh, myself, I'm producing contents every day and I'm contributing to the media as well. So for advertisers, there are now more channels to reach and how? This is always a question that uh, we would ask. And basically, I personally, I think it's not about the new media. It's basically about smart targeting how you are able to integrate all the ways that you know, we can interact with our customers with, uh, uh, with, uh, with different times and different locations, different channels, and that would be the key. And this is actually the traditional media timeline. It's linear, you know, you wake up in the morning with prints, with TV, with uh, radio, with uh, uh, our phone to watch when we get out, and office, with internet, and so on and so on. This is actually the traditional thinking of planning media, but we have our own new methodology where we think it's, it should be point to point, it should be anytime, anywhere. And being able to put all the elements, all the channels together in uh, uh, media planning is very important where you have mobile, internet, traditional media platforms, and events, and all kinds of elements. This is how we are attracting different kinds of at consumers. And if you can look at the um, right hand side, it's actually the action where we would uh, help our clients to plan um, in order to how we are going to promote and how to viral the marketing message, uh, how to announce it, how to follow by, as well as interact with the customers. In terms of new media, I think we cover most of uh, the actions, but traditional media. Uh, we will not neglect because it is important to have tra traditional media platform to support the entire campaign. And however, uh, tradi traditional media, uh, as you can see, it's very hard to do viral effects and it's very hard to follow through and it's difficult to interact unless you do some kinds of events. So I would say if we can combine new media and traditional media together, it would be a very powerful uh, um, uh, uh, media platform to, to promote your brand. So, since information can be consumed and produced by anyone, uh, I think engagement is very important. Uh, in order to get constant feedback, is uh, very important. And the ability to quickly discover what your friends find interesting and important will be you know, very uh, crucial. So, in terms of what, uh, why I say friend, friend is actually your customer. Because nowadays, if we look at um, social media, friend is actually the key point of uh, the strategy. And um, in terms of the approach, I would say, first, you need to be their friend, and be remarkable, be real, and be yourself. And if you have a brand, you need a character. And you need to be fun. Um, you need to make sure that uh, they are comfortable with you, and you know it's just like hanging out with your best friends, and be helpful, very supportive, and it's about love and friendship. So um, I totally agree with Sean that uh, we can just dump it uh, on the advertising message and on their face. So being able to share with them and you know, share with them kinds of articles and share you know, useful contents that would be very crucial if you um, are going to plan new media. Uh, and nowadays. So, uh, the other important thing is actually create channels. I would say all kinds, of, all kinds of channels. Traditional channels, social media channels, mobile channels, digital out home channels. You should take time to create all your channels and then look at how you can actually reach out to customers. And once you create all these channels, um, we break it down into different spots. So in terms of online, 
I would say you need to build your database, you know, keep on sending them emails and uh, e uh, digital marketing um, uh, newsletters. Uh, create a user friendly website, um, link it with RSS, post on with different kinds of banners. Um, make sure you are searchable on Yahoo, Google. Make sure uh, you rank high with SEO, uh, promote uh, your, your, your product with SEM. Um, start your Facebook. Start your Facebook application or start your Facebook fans club. Uh, you know, log into Twitter, make sure that your customers will follow you. This is the online part. And mobile part, you know, SMS is quite uh, common nowadays where you can actually um, get engaged with your customers right away. And same as MMS, which is a little bit expensive at the moment. But building iPhone applications, I think, is the trend. Uh, being able to build you know, Blackberry's uh, applications or uh, Nokia's OB applications would be, would be very important as well. Whereas you, you should reach your customers through Bluetooth or Wi Fi technologies. And, but also make sure that <coughs> you are connected with them through all different kinds of offline, can, offline uh, mediums, which is direct mail, radio, TV, magazine, posters, files, that still these are. Uh, you know, keep on doing uh, what traditional media is working on. But the most important part is actually the campaign management where uh, we are able to know the user and be able to personalize messages or personalize campaigns for them. And uh, reporting, building a CRM system, and do automations of different kinds of administrations. So these are actually uh, the, the key elements that you need to build. And once you build it, I believe that uh, the viral effects uh, will go itself online, on mobile, on digital at home, and through uh, word of mouth, or digital word of mouth, I would say. So this is the actual viral marketing effects. And consumers will become your salesmen, and they will become part of your brand. So this is how we think the new media will become in the future. So what's names? Uh, Trend is changing, and there are some um, ideas that I would like to share. Um, I think application matters. Uh, you know, we used to change our mobile phone every two months or uh, two quarters, or you know, every year. But nowadays, mobile phone is no longer important. The most important thing is actually the application on your mobile. Um, I think that applications are unique for each user, and that is also a long tail. Uh, model and it's very personal. So probably if you are thinking of starting an online shop, probably you start an iPhone shop. That would be the future. And the next one is actually LBS advertising, location-based advertising. This is actually a company in Paris. Uh, they uh, developed uh, AR augmented reality on iPhone. You are able to use your iPhone to spot down the location where you are at and where are all the retail shops um, by showing, you know, uh, uh, pointing your iPhone camera and it shows you all the directions and all that information. And I think location-based advertising will be coming within the next two to three years where you are being able to pinpoint down to your customers where they are at at a particular time and provide them uh, useful content and information and the last one is actually, you know, with traditional media being able to integrate with internet, mobile, and digital out of home. So this is actually uh, where we think uh, people will actually provide contents and just like the uh, Guinness campaign, you know, it's all integrated mobile, online, uh, and, and digital out of home. So this is actually a future that we truly believe as well. All right, so uh, this is actually our company. Uh, some of the uh, projects that we have done for our clients, uh, it's all new media items. We do interactive kiosks, we do online campaigns, online promotions, we do Facebook apps, iPhone applications, uh, LED, SMS, location-based uh, promotion, promotion, we do digital at home. So basically, this is how we you know, keep on thinking Things are changing. Okay, so that's it. Thank you.